Hello viewers, welcome back to our Busy Bee channel. Today we are here to discuss about the topic blood, which is a part of our life dependent on that. Blood is a body fluid in humans and other animals that delivers necessary substance such as nutrients and oxygen to the cells and transport metabolic waste products away from those same cells. In vertebrates, it is composed of blood cells suspended in blood plasma. Blood is important to us, very, very important to us. We should donate blood which saves others' life. Now, let me welcome Renuka of 10th Standard from the Great the National IT International Matriculation High Secondary School to orate on the topic, blood. Hi everyone, I am Renuka of Class 10 from National IT International Matriculation High Secondary School. I am here to share the topic, blood. Blood is the main circulatory medium in the human body. It is partly red colored fluid conjunctive tissue. Blood consists of fluid plasma and formed elements blood corpuscles. Plasma is a slightly alkaline substance. It is constituted about 55% of the blood. The organic substances present in the plasma are urea, vitamins, minerals and proteins. Blood corpuscles divided into three types. There are red blood corpuscles or erythrocytes, white blood corpuscles or leukocytes, red platelets or thrombocytes. Red blood corpuscles. They are red in color due to the presence of the oxygen pigment hemoglobin. Their lifespan is about 120 days. They found in bone marrow, WBC. They are colorless and they do not have any nucleus. They found in lymph nodes and thymus. There are two types of the WBC, namely granulocytes and granulocytes. Granules present in the cytoplasm are called granulocytes. There are three types of the granulocytes, namely neutrophils, eosinophils, and basophils. Neutrophils. They are 2 to 7 lobe nucleus. They constitute about 60 to 65% of the total WBZ. Eosinophils, they have bilobe nucleus. They constitute about 2 to 5% of the WBC. Basophils, they are lobe nucleus. They constitute about 0.5 to 1% of the WBZ. Granules absent in the cytoplasm are called agranulocytes. There are two types of the agranulocytes, namely lymphocyte and monocyte. Lymphocyte, they constitute about 20 to 25% of the WBC. Monocyte, they constitute about 2 to 5% of the WBC. Red platelets, they do not have any color and do not have any nucleus. They are about 250,000 to 4 lakh cubic millimeter platelets. They play an important role in flooding of the blood. Transport of the respiratory gases, oxygen and carbon dioxide. Transport of the digestive food materials through different voices. Transport of the hormones. It is involved in the protection of the body and defense against diseases. It maintains the proper water balance in the body. Thank you. Get more updates in our busy channel. Like, share, subscribe and click the bell icon. Thank you.